Hi. So I wanted to talk about something that I've been struggling with and I feel like it's a pretty common thing. Um, and that is the whole concept of really wanting to do something and you're so excited about it. You um, have all this excitement and passion and you can really feel like it is aligned with yourself, your heart, but then all of a sudden it just doesn't happen and your little brain starts to get working on you and you come up with all of these reasons why you shouldn't or you can't. I'll give you a personal example making this video. All of a sudden I'm like, yeah, I want to make a video. And then I start thinking, oh, I don't have my mascara on or who's going to watch this video or, you know, like I'm just not feeling it. My hair is like three days hasn't been washed and I'm just not sure. And the thing is, that is our conscious brain trying to keep us safe. So if you're unfamiliar with the whole idea of your conscious and your subconscious mind, I'm going to talk about that more in depth at a later date. But your conscious brain is this little lizard brain. They call it the monkey mind. And it's the thing that keeps you from progressing. But the thing is, is like all it wants for you is to be safe. And so it will do whatever it takes to keep you safe. And it doesn't know sometimes that what you want to do, what like is coming from your heart is okay for you to do. And it's still safe. So I want to give you a tool to combat that monkey mind, lizard brain, overthinking analyzation. Um, so you can just start to break free of that. And it's as simple as commanding your brain, because you actually have power over it, to do what you want to do. And it goes like this. So all you have to do is um, place your hands over your heart and close your eyes and just really think about what you want to be doing. And allow your brain to bring up all of the things that it's telling you. And focus on your heart. And what you're going to do is say, brain, thank you for keeping me safe. I appreciate you and all that you do for me. But I choose to move forward. And I need you to let me do that. And that's it. It takes as little or as long as you want, but all you have to do is just take a moment and say, thank you. I really appreciate you, brain, for keeping me safe all of these years. I'm still alive because of you, um, but I choose something else and that's okay too. And then it's the practice of baby steps one at a time. And I'm still working on that too. It really is a practice. But getting the control back and telling your brain no more, no thank you, I choose something else is a really great first step. So try it out and let me know if that helps you at all. Um, and I really hope it does. It's simple um, in concept, but it takes some practice. Take care.